Hello everyone, this is Priyanshi and I welcome you all on Adventure. As you know, we are going through a series of Topper's Talk. Let me tell you, all the toppers that are going to be here are chosen through a survey form that was released by Adventure. And from that, we have got around 200 plus entries from which we have selected some toppers who are going to talk with us and we are going to know their experience, their strategies and let you know more about them. So, in today's video, we are going to have Moriwardhan Singh who secured 99.17% in grade 10 and a student of Sir Padampat Singhanya School Kota. So, let's have a talk with Moriwardhan. Okay, so Moriwardhan, how are you? I'm fine. So can you please introduce yourself to our viewers? Myself, Maury Vardhan Singh from Sir Badapat Singh Anya School. Okay, Maury Vardhan. So what was your and your family's reaction after such an amazing achievement by you? My family members were very happy and they were proud of me on seeing my result. And so I was also ex very excited. Sorry? I was also very excited. So have you expected this kind of marks? No, I didn't ex accept. Uh, I don't, I didn't expect this marks, but uh, near about this only. Nice. So who would you like to attribute your success to? Do you want to share your success to them? I would attribute my success to my worthy teachers and my parents and especially my mom because she too was a meritorious student in class 10. So she always motivated me to score higher than her. So that was the source of motivation for me. Right. That's so nice. So what was, can you please uh, tell us your strategy for each subject that you study? My strategy was that uh, I devoted my time equally to all the subjects and gave extra time to mathematics because it required a lot of questions to be solved to get perfection in the topic. Right. So was maths your favorite subject? Yes, it was my favorite subject. So you gave a more time to maths because it was your favorite or you gave, uh, gave it more time because it required more effort than any other subject? Yes, it required more efforts. Okay, nice to hear that. So, uh, can you please uh, tell us, have you changed your strategy of studying while you were in class 9th, 8th, uh, 8th, 9th, and then you came to class 10th and you changed your strategy or was it same in every class you went through? Uh, yes, definitely. From class 7th to class 9th, I was focused towards my studies, but I also enrolled myself in co-curricular activities. But from class 10th, I was totally focused towards the studies and because I wanted to uh, score good in class 10 board. So, you have not participated extra co-curricular activity mein participate nahi karain when you were in class 10th? Were you totally focused on your studies? No, the co-curricular activities that were held by the school in the online mode, I participated in them. So can you share with us any activity that you participate or your hobby that you used to also do other than your studies? Uh, the co-curricular activities that I participated uh, was that uh, there was a, uh, like, uh, my school held a online competition. I played indoor games. Right. So that keeps you refreshed well, other than while you are studying, right? Yes. Uh, for relaxation, I also watched movies. Nice. So can you share with us any reference book which you used other than NCRT? Yes, I used uh, NCRT Exemplar for maths. Okay. And uh, for rest of the subjects, I preferred NCRT only because it was more than enough. Right. So means basically... If you don't reference book, nahi bhi dekke, NCRT ko agar se padh lete to, that's enough, right? Yes, NCRT is more than enough to score good in class 10. Okay, great to hear that. So, what do you think are coachings and uh, going to great tuitions are 
uh, necessary for scoring good or are they like if we don't even go to coachings and tuition then also we can score better on our own as well yes i totally disagree with that fact that coachings are necessary for good marks uh, because it's all about self study coachings and tuitions are meant for preparations of various competitive and olympiads so right. i think self study is must to get good marks right so aapne bhi self study kari thi pure saal no i enrolled myself in coaching uh, for preparation of uh, competitive exams okay nice so were you preparing preparing for your uh, competitive as well as for your 10th at the same time yes that's so amazing so have you faced any difficulties or distraction while you were studying in online mode yes while attending online classes uh, many a times there were uh, like technical issues or network issues and i got right. disconnected from the class and some concepts remained unclear but for that i approached my teachers and they replied in affirmative uh, like they were always available for us to solve our doubts and queries so my teachers are very helpful nice so actually means uh, your friends your teachers and your parents actually played a great role for you yes definitely nice so uh, as we are completed with your grade 10 what subjects are you going to take in your uh, 11th i have opted for pcm and i aim towards iit you aim for iit yes okay wish you a great luck you have something amazing you will do in future so um, every time you felt demotivated or stressed while you study so what you you uh, what you used to do to cheer yourself up khud ko aise matlab wapas se motivate karne ke liye aisa kya karte the uh, when i got uh, uh, stressed or demotivated while studying i talk to my parents like they were the source of motivation for me they always shared their experiences in the life with me and uh, always gave me new ideas and strategies if uh, i was like i faced difficulty in any subject or any like thing like that. so can you remember any words by your uh, teachers or your parents that actually made you feel like yes i can do it now uh, yes i remember the words of my father once he said that uh, agar aapke man mein aapke goal ke liye determination hai aap usko achieve karna chahte ho to aapko koi rok nahi sakta aur you will definitely achieve it nice that are really great words for everybody right now now abhi bahut bar aisa hota hai ki hum paper dekar aate hain aur bahut bar aisa hota hai ki humne expect kuch kiya hota hai aur humko ya to usse bahut kam jab milta hai तो बेसिकली उस टाइम पर बहुत ज्यादा डिसअपॉइंटमेंट फील होता है तो आपके साथ कभी ऐसा होता था कि कोई सी भी क्लास में और बेसिकली टेंथ तो एक्चुअली बोर्ड क्लास है तो वहां पर हमें ज्यादा फील होता है ये मार्क्स को लेकर जितनी भी प्रॉब्लम्स वगैरह होती है तो ऐसी कोई डिसअपॉइंटमेंट आपको फील हुई थी नहीं मेरे जब भी मार्क्स आते थे तो मार्क्स तो मैंने जितने एक्सपेक्ट किए थे उसके अराउंड आते थे लेकिन जब भी मार्क्स कम आते थे एक्सपेक्टेड से तो मैं ये जरूर इंश्योर करता था कि जो मैंने मिस्टेक्स की उनको मैं एनालाइज करूं और उसको रिपीट ना करूं ताकि फिर अगली बार जब भी एग्जाम हो तो मेरी मिस्टेक्स रिमूव होती चले और फिर एट द एंड मैं कोई मिस्टेक ना करूं बोल में तो अभी जैसे हमने पहले दो इंटरव्यू लिए थे उनके अकॉर्डिंग जो हमारे पास टॉपर्स थे उन दोनों के अकॉर्डिंग यही था कि आपकी पढ़ाई टॉपिक वाइज होनी चाहिए फिर पहले ही उसमें आपकी टाइम लिमिट कितनी भी बड़े या कम हो तो आपकी भी yes, जो स्ट्रेटजी है या जो टाइम टेबल है वो इसी टाइप का होता था या कुछ चेंज था आपकी टाइम टेबल और स्ट्रेटजी में यस आई स्टडी टॉपिक वाइज मैं चैप्टर्स फिक्स करता था कि मेरे को इस दिन में ये चैप्टर कंप्लीट करना है और मैं उसके हिसाब से उसको टाइम देता था राइट सो नाइस सो कैन आई आस्क यू डू यू हैव एनी रोल मॉडल हु यू लुक अप टू और आप ंग्लूडिंग फ्रॉम 
uh, education to from from studies to co curricular activities to decision making and everything like she always set it a goal for me that i need to complete right right amazing so you really look up to your mother for great things and as a role model for you yes that really sounds so amazing <laughs> so can you please tell anything any piece of advice or piece of motivation to the upcoming batches or who are going to appear in the boards this year or coming years yes sir, i would like to advise all the students of class 10th that uh, they should follow a proper systematic timetable for their study throughout the year they should be consistent and one more thing they should be Thoro with the NCERT books because NCERT book is the key to score hundred on hundred in every subject in class ten board. Right. Thank you so much, Mori Vardhan, for joining us, and we really congratulate you once again. And thank you for joining us on the show, and we hope you have a great future ahead. Thank you so much. I really think you got some amazing strategies and words of motivation from Morivardhan. Thank you so much for watching. Also, if you want to know more from these toppers, subscribe to the channel right now and like and share this video.